G'day. Today I finally have time to actually open and replace my Amaran F22 and F21 brackets. I had these delivered ages ago and I just haven't had a chance to actually go through them. So I thought why not uh, make a video of it. So this is the old style bracket. I mean it did its job but you had to kind of bend it to make it work and I did have a couple of occasions where the mat actually slipped out from it and you kind of, it's a bit clumsy on set. So really stoked that they replaced it. Um, the replacement was free, but I think I had to pay about 22 bucks for shipping, but Australia is a big place, so it uh, costs a fair bit to send stuff around. So we'll get into the new one. Rightio, so it comes with a bag, branded, very exciting. So you can pretty much get rid of the cushioning. So a nice little Velcro strap to keep the arms together when packed up. And that's cool, it's got the built-in kind of grip arm. Um, I'll just show you down here, the, the arms pull out and slide in. So you kind of pull out, slide it in, pull out. Probably lay the mat flat, I guess. Do it backwards, upside down. So these rods are tension based, so you can push them in. So just pick, put the first two in, and then you can push, kind of put pressure on the end and slide it in. And then that'll clip under there. So that's actually super simple. I really like that. It doesn't feel like it's gonna come away. There's enough room on those hooks to hold it in place. So I think overall that's a really well thought out bracket. And yeah, I really do appreciate a brand kind of owning the first one not being great and coming out with a solution. So naturally the F21 um, looks a lot smaller. Still with a lovely little bag. So I'll just show you again, putting these together. So you pull it out and slide it in. So you pull it out, slide it in, pull it out. So that's really handy. And then you got these which are spring loaded kind of tension based. Simple as that. Right, yeah, so I'll pop that up on the grip. So checking it on a boom arm, simple. It's nice and sturdy now. I was always afraid when hanging it above talent for a hair light with the old bracket that those curves were just too easy to slip out. So very stoked with the new version and uh, I feel much more confident that I'm not gonna hurt someone on set. I'll build the rest of it on there. Everything feels much better now with that bracket. So back to back, you can kind of see the difference. Um, you've got a frame that needed to be curved and bended and the mounting point did have a little bit of give um, in the bracket, whether you use the, the bent arm or the straight arm. And here we've got just a much firmer, stronger grip, so much more confident. So if you haven't already ordered your replacement brackets or uh, I'm not sure if, the, if there's a, a date for the uh, free replacement, but I'd definitely suggest buying them if, if they are costly now as well. I just think you'll have a, a much better time on set and a safer option all around. The other thing I suggest as well with the Amaran series is just buying the quick release. They're about $100, but just being able to get your control box mounted makes it much easier than just hanging it. It's got a, a, a cable, but I just didn't like how it flopped around. So especially when you've got a battery on the back, you're definitely gonna be having a much better time if you just invest in the bracket. 
So as you can see here, with a quick release bracket, set of wheels and a V-lock, you can actually get yourself wireless light on a stand. So that makes it super easy on set if you don't need cables around everywhere, even for your boom light. So there you go, that's the replacement brackets for the Amaran F21 and the F22. If you uh, got something out of this, make sure you uh, like and subscribe, otherwise we'll talk to you in the next one. I'm gonna switch off and uh, go do some work.